Two options. You type so, so fast or die. You drowned in lava. Quickly, name an object you use to eat food. Gotta be a spork, doesn't it? So we are playing Roblox Type or Die. There are two main elements to this game. We've got speed, and then we've also got length of answer. The more letters in my answer, the higher my little tower will get, and then I will be safe. Safe for a time, because the lava, she rises. I can feel the heat. I must think of longer words. Name a month in the year. Okay, well, I know lots of months in the year, but which one is the longest? What's gonna get me the longest answer? November? Feels pretty long. My tower is already upsettingly teeny-weeny compared to my competitors here because I put spork instead of chopsticks. Chopsticks was a much better answer. Oh, no. That's all right. The game is just beginning. I've got lots of time to build my tower. You gotta be fast, but you gotta think of the longest answer, too. Name a natural disaster. Uh, fires. Cyclones. Which one is the longest? What about tornado? Uh, tornado. Correct. Seven blocks. Oh, my gosh. Look how tall they are. Volcanic eruption? Yeah, that's why Vamp up there is an expert. That was an expert move. I'm just a beginner. And Catseek over there with their volcanic eruption? Oh my gosh, the lava, she's rising. If you're watching this and you think of a better answer than me, put it in the comment section. I need help for next time. It's time to name something sharp. Okay, we got scissors, we got sewing needles, we got, what's the longest though? Oh my gosh, look how long theirs is. Okay, how about ninja sword? No, okay, um, machete? Okay, it's, it's a good word, but it's not very long. Ooh, katana, that's a cool one. I think that's like a long Japanese sword. The sword is long, but not the word, it's only six letters. Your katana might not keep you safe from the lava. Okay, everyone's safe for now, but Vamp and Catseek are like rocketing towards the top of the volcano. Name something you keep in the car. Uh, garbage, uh, dog hair, empty 7-Eleven Slurpee cups. Okay, what about spare tire? What? Oh, maybe I spelled it wrong, let's try again. Okay, rude, it's not my fault. I don't know how to drive. Uh, what about baby seat? No, okay, what else do you call it? Car seat. Okay, seven blocks. Just in the nick of time. Okay, it's not a great answer, but at least I got an answer in. Look at cat seek. Oh, driver's license. That's a really good one. Name, a potato chip flavor. Oh my gosh, it's my time to shine. I've got a really long one. Sour cream and onion. Yes, 17 blocks. Wait, what? Everyone else, is, everyone else is doing sour cream and onion. That is my chip flavor. <gasps> Ooh, Game for No Good over there did sour cream, but they forgot about the onions. Those are free blocks, but you are going to get swallowed up by lava if you keep doing that. Cat's <laughs> over here just standing on top of a giant skyscraper. He's fine. My time will come. It's time to name a phone brand. Uh-oh. Right, I have an iPhone. That's not very long. What about a Samsung Galaxy? You kidding? Okay, what about just Samsung? Okay, correct. Seven blocks though, that's not very good. What's everyone else saying? I don't even know that many kinds of phones. What else could you say? If you have a better answer, please tell me. What did Catseek say? Catseek, my guiding light. Uh oh, the lava's rising. Good old game for no good, just going with iPhone. Oh, Blackberry, that's a pretty good one. It's fine, next question. Name a billionaire. Okay, billionaires, we got Jeff Bezos, we got Bill Gates, we got Elon Musk. They've all got such short names. The uh, Bill Gates. Yeah, nine blocks. That's, that's pretty good. Oh, Jeff Bezos, I see you over there. Oh, <gasps> Mark Zuckerberg! Catseek, you did it again. This is why Catseek is a superstar. You don't get to superstar status overnight, you know. Name something you would find in a living room. It's gotta be long. It's gotta be television set. Oh, they took away my set. Okay, television is 10 blocks. That's fine. Would have loved 13. <gasps> what everyone else is saying? <gasps> Flat screen television? That is really long. Why did they get flat screen television and I could not get television set? I'm so sorry to say this, but I believe that the game has been rigged. Some of these answers, I'm just not sure about it. But I still want to win. 13 blocks? Oh my gosh. It's time to name something you keep in a wallet. Driver's license. That is nice and long. 14 blocks. We love to see it. But what will Catseek and Vamp say? I can like barely see them. <laughs> They're like rocketing out the top of the volcano. <laughs> They're gonna escape. <laughs> oh, everyone said driver's license. Okay, cool. I guess that was the best answer. Like if Vamp and Catseek are doing it, then it must be the right one. Like they are the yardstick by which I measure all my success in type or die. What happens when they reach the top? Name a Disney movie. Okay, I know lots of Disney movies, but what's a really long one? Uh, the Beauty and the Beast. She is long. That is 17 blocks. Read it and weep, guys. Read it and weep. 
Ooh, oh, there goes Catsy. <laughs> just fly into the top. I can't even read that. They're so far away. <gasps> oh my gosh, it just keeps going. Okay, the lion, the witch, and the wardrobe. Didn't even know that that was a Disney movie, but well done. Name a day of the week. Which day of the week is the longest? They're all kind of similar, aren't they? Uh, Saturday. That's a good one. Dang, but now that I'm thinking about it, Wednesday is probably longer. Thursday. All right. It's, it's not a make or break question. You know what I mean? There, there was a limited number of answers. Thursday. All right. Thursday is good. Okay, Catsy just on the top of Mount Everest there, and I am down here in the trenches about to get swallowed up by lava. <gasps> lava will raise 11 blocks if I don't name a character from Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's actually kind of a hard one. I feel like I'm going to run out of time. I mean, there's Sonic, but that can't be the right answer. Anyone other than Sonic Knuckles. Eight blocks. That's not bad. We can perform under pressure. He's not going to save me from the lake of fire, but... Oh, yep, there it comes. <laughs> Look, I haven't run out of time yet on a single answer, so I gotta, I gotta take my wins. Name a type of bear. I'm from Canada. I know all the kinds of bears. Grizzly bear is probably the longest of all the bears. I could have also said spirit bear. Spirit bears are a type of black bear, but they are different because they have white fur. So they kind of look like a ghost. And some First Nations groups, where I'm from, believe that they are sacred. It's pretty cool stuff. Yeah, that's right. We're typing. We're cheating death. We're learning about different kinds of bears. It's all happening here inside the volcano. Oh my gosh, 31 blocks. Name a farmyard animal. Okay, I know lots of farmyard animals, but which one is the longest? A what, the cow that's really short, a donkey. What is a long rooster? Could be chicken. What's longer, chicken or rooster? Uh, rooster. Seven blocks. Okay, it's not my best work. 31 blocks. The lava is going to rise. Okay, bit worrying. It's getting quite a lot higher. Okay, it is coming for me. I can feel the heat. Am I about to get crisped? Am I at the end? Oh, no. yeah, okay. Goodbye, comrade, into the lava. I'm doing this for you. Okay, it's time to name something you can climb. Well, that's obvious. Cat seeks word tower. Oh, no. The Empire State Building. That's nice and long. <gasps> You're joking. But that's a great answer. Okay, what about Mount Everest? Cool, 12 blocks. We got it. Mountain. You could have named a specific mountain. Would have done a bit better. Oh my gosh, it's really coming. She's getting closer. Closer, no! <laughs> We're fourth. Now that I've had a practice round, I want hard mode. I'm not a beginner anymore, okay? I am naming a type of transportation. Okay, there's cars, there's trams. Those are short. That's not going to do it. We need something long. We need um, like a Shinkansen. We need a high-speed rail. You're joking. Okay, high-speed trains. Why, though? Look at trains. Train. Oh, my gosh. Five blocks. That's so embarrassing. Okay, give this video a thumbs up if you think that my answer should have been accepted because I think that was actually a great answer. High-speed rail. Indisputably a form of transport. Okay, time to name a winter Olympic sport. Snowboarding. Oh, no, a snowboard. Where's my ing? Oh, see, skiing, they get an ing. Where's my ing? Also just noticing in the background that Cat Seek's form of transportation was teleportation and I couldn't get away with high-speed rail? Like, what? I need to have a word with the creators of this game. <laughs> what do you have against the beautiful and majestic train? She's got a dining cart. She is gliding through the countryside. It's a whole vibe. It's time to name a country in South America. Ooh, there's lots of long ones. How do I spell Venezuela? How about Argentina? I can spell Argentina. It's hard to spell Venezuela under pressure. That's a good question. If you have a longer one, write your answer in the comment section. I want to see everybody's answers. Catseek also went for Argentina. I see you. Well done. Uh, Brazil? It's good. It's not very long. I think our other two contestants are struggling to think of a country. It's tough under pressure. I get it. But the lava, she's rising. All right, better luck next time with that question, guys. I think that's the only time I've seen people not answer. Name a position in American football. Quarterback. Literally the only position I know. Hey, it corrected it to the wrong spelling. Did you see that or did I just imagine that? I swear I typed it right and then it corrected it to the wrong spelling. Okay, that was weird. Maybe I am imagining things, but now the position is actually quarterback. It kind of sounds like an Australian accent. Quarterback. I am tall. I am strong. I am doing so well at hard mode. It's like, why does it still say I'm a beginner? <gasps> Where did Catseek go? Name a consumable from Fortnite. If Catseek is gone, does that mean that I actually have a chance of winning this game? Okay, chug jug. Seven blocks. Not my best work, but that is fine. I cannot believe that Catseek has forfeited the game. 
She was doing so well. She was like the tallest one. Maybe she got kicked off the server. Maybe she had to go to dinner. But now, who's the tallest? Yeah, that's me. By the way, if you want to support my channel for free and make me feel very, very happy, you can subscribe to my channel. It's very fun. We have a nice time here. Name a type of pasta noodle. Oh my gosh, it is my specialty. Spaghetti is a nice, long pasta noodle, but we've also got farfedelli. That's not a word. Tortellini. Fettuccine. Angel hair. I could go on for days. Sp spaghetti was the first one that came to my mind, though, and I reckon it's pretty good. Nine blocks. Not bad. I am the tallest. Oh, and I've been upgraded to amateur. Yeah. Who's an amateur? Ooh, watch out, anime. You are in hot water. Name a Pixar movie. Okay. Why am I drawing a blank? Who makes different movies up? Up is a Pixar movie, I think, but it's like the shortest word in the world. Okay, Toy Story 3. Yeah, I could have just said Toy Story, but I added a three. That's how you get that extra block. That's the kind of cool move you do when you move from beginner to amateur. Move aside, folks, I'm an amateur. Let me through. Okay, the lava, it's getting closer. <laughs> Looks like it wants to swallow everybody up, but I'm feeling so tall. This might be my game. Watch out, everyone. Name a country in North America. Pretty sure there are only three countries. We got the United States, we got Canada, and we got Mexico. I'm going for Canada. That is my home. United States of America probably would have been the best answer because that's the longest, but you know what? I'm feeling confident. So I just went for the, the old home country. Um, Alexa, are you gonna answer? Alexa, think of a country! Quickly! Oh no, it's too late! All right, brutal. It's just you and me now, Anime X4G. It's time to name a character from Encanto. That is hard. I'm not good at remembering the names of characters. Okay, name a single character, any character. And then of course I need to spell their name. Okay, this is hard. Uh, Mirabelle, um, but how do I spell? Okay, just to have a crack. What about this? Nope. And I'm out of time. Okay, didn't answer that question. That's not great. And the lava's rising. Why you gotta rise there, bud? Okay, we're cool, it's fine. I just need to absolutely slay the next question or I'm going to get swallowed by the lava. Name one of the seven dwarfs from Snow White. Do any of them have middle names? I need something real long. Oh no, okay, Sleepy. That's just not long at all, it's six blocks. Okay, I think I might be safe depending on what anime answers. This might be the end of the game. Oh my gosh, Doc! <gasps> anime, that was not your finest moment. Watch out! Ooh, yeah. Oh my gosh, am I the wiener? I think I'm the big wiener. Woohoo, we place first. I would like to dedicate this win to Catseek. You're a huge inspiration to me, setting the bar high. 